welcome back to my YouTube channel. <laughs> I'm so, so excited to be back here with you guys today because today I'm going to show you how I went from curly to straight hair, which I did add curls to it, so now it's like straight curly hair. I don't know, it's, you know, definitely a looser pattern curl. Um, you'll see why in the video as to why I did add some curls to it, just because my hair was entirely too long. You guys may know, and some of you may not know, I have, been, I have not straightened my hair in about a year and eight months, so this was definitely an experiment. I did it on my birthday, so I was like, ah, these are the final results. You guys see in the video, I'll take you on my getting my hair straight journey. And I will let you guys know my thoughts afterwards, after you guys see the finished product. So I hope you guys like this video. I won't keep talking too much, so I have to get right into it. Um, I'm actually going out to the salon to have it put in rollers because I don't have a hooded dryer. And if it does not, be, if it's not put in rollers, it won't um, turn out well. So my hair is already washed and conditioned. I had put a deep conditioning mask in it the night before. Um, so it, I made sure that I had my hair nice and moisturized. Then it's been washed and conditioned, and I'll show you guys what I do after that. I brushed it all out, and I detangled it and everything so the salon doesn't have to. Ugh. And I just put it in these two little piggy tail braids. They're wet. Um, so I'm going to go to the salon. I do bring all my own supplies, so I'm bringing my own heat protectants and my own conditioner and my own detangling brush so they don't go ripping through my hair. So when I get to the salon, I'll show you guys how, how they put them in the rollers. I'll sit under the dryer and then I'll leave and I'll come finish the process myself at home. Okay guys, I just left the salon. All they did was they put my hair in a roller set and I sat under the dryer for about two and a half hours on medium heat so it wasn't too hot and I did put a heat protectant on my hair. This is what my hair looks like now. I'm gonna actually go through and um, fix the, the roots. I'm just okay guys so here's my hair in all of its glory I'm looking so crazy right now um all I'm going to do is actually put it into a pony a bun on the top of my head to help with some of this frizziness and I'll be done I'll show you guys the final results Okay guys, so I hope you liked that video. As you guys can see, my hair was extremely, extremely long. So the process did take a little longer since I didn't want too much heat on my hair. Um, as you guys know, I was under the dryer and I didn't have that much vlog footage of me being under the dryer just sitting there with rollers in my hair for two and a half hours because it didn't make any sense. When I got home, I just blew it out on medium to cool air, which you guys seen in the video. I will, I will say that after I finally did straighten my hair, I don't think I'm going to straighten it again. And if I do, it's going to be a very, very, very long time from now. Just because as much, I used to love straight hair so much. This is just a testament to how far I've come and how much I've come to love my curly hair. Because I was just like, this isn't even that cool. Everybody has straight hair and it looks good, yeah. But I don't love it. I don't love it as much as I love my curly hair, which is a great testament. 
um, to how much I've come to embrace and love my hair. So make sure whatever kind of hair you have, you love it. Love yourself, self-love, people, self-love. Um, so there you guys have it. That's how I went from curly to straight hair. And I hope you guys really liked this video. Thank you so much for watching. And make sure if you did like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And if you didn't like this video, so give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thank you for watching.